Excuse me, sir. Um, what's your name? Uh, Matt Matheny. Uh, what do you do for a living? Uh, I work at the Amazon Center for Quantum Computing. Um, how would you explain quantum computing in uh, simple terms? Uh, quantum computing, um, it's essentially where you take advantage of certain properties of quantum mechanics to do computations such as entanglement and uh, uh, state collapse. Uh, would you say your job is more um, technical or creative? Uh, my job is more uh, creative, I'd say, but there are technical aspects to it. Um, what would you say is the most like satisfying part of your job and the most challenging part of your job? Well, since I'm a manager, the most satisfying part is to see the people who work with me and the people I manage to grow in their careers and to you know become uh, more mature and, and uh, you know advanced. The most challenging part is to be able to weigh uh, success versus risk. Um, tell me a bit about your background. Um, where did you go to college and what did you major in? So I went to the University of Kansas for undergraduate and I, uh, I got my degree, uh, one degree in mathematics and one degree in physics. And then I went to graduate school at Caltech uh, and, then be and then for physics. And then afterwards I stayed on at, at Caltech for, as, a, as a staff scientist. Um, what were some notable projects that you've been involved in? Uh, well, one of the notable projects at Caltech was where I worked on a project on network dynamics, where, where I was building experiments around that, trying to see if, uh, you know, how these network dynamics, uh, you know, showed up versus uh, like having virtual interactions between different faraway agents. Uh, the second project I worked on, uh, this was at AWS, was a project in quantum computing where we encoded a, uh, a, a large quantum state in a number, a large number of quantum objects. And finally, what advice would you give to um, others that want to pursue a career similar to yours? Well, if you're interested in it, I would definitely encourage you to do it. Like, you shouldn't do it for the money. You should definitely do it because you really love science. Yeah, thank you very much.